Yo, what's up, guys? Welcome back to Baker's Lab. My name is Baker, and there is some crazy new cards coming to Clash Royale. Check them out, dude. One of them you know, it's the Bowler. It's from Clash of Clans. It does pretty unique stuff. I mean, it throws a rock, and that rock bounces twice, and it does incredible damage. That's going to be pretty sick. And the other one, guys, is the Ice Spirit. So that's totally new. We've never seen that before, but it's kind of like the Fire Spirit. It's just going to freeze stuff, obviously. Good job, Eek. Nice explanation. So let's check these out, guys. We're in the developer build right now, so we can check them out. Let's do it. All right, guys, so we'll look at the stats after this. But the first thing I want to show you is how similar and how different the bowler is to the Royal Giant. Now, that was the first thing I thought. I'm like, yo, this is just going to be another super annoying Royal Giant, right? Yeah, because he's got big health and he does um, pretty good range as well. But this is the big difference right here. The bowler can defend check this out man so he can also hit two things we'll try to hopefully see that in a little bit he can hit two things but it's kind of hard to actually get it to work there's the ice spirit right there boom freezes something for a good like two seconds something like that it freezes for quite some time so expect those ice spirits to be really widely used i mean i think it's just one ice spirit so it's going to be kind of tricky it's going to be easy to for it to die but if it doesn't die and it actually gets to its target it's going to be pretty awesome. So you can see there, you know, the, the bowler is not scared to defend. <laughs> He'll like turn around and start shooting at a hog rider there. So that's going to be pretty sick. Unlike the, the royal giant who obviously just, you know, sits there shooting the tower. This guy's going to fight back. So that's a totally different thing there. Let's, uh, let's just try to kill this balloon and then move on. So you know what I want to do next, guys? I, I'm going to, I'm going to get an elixir collector going and then I want to get a bowler on one side and i want to get the royal giant on the other side and we'll look at them we'll sort of compare them uh yeah both towers are pretty much similar so we'll do that in just a second let me get the elixir up here because these are very expensive you know like the the bowler is just like the royal giant it's six elixir so it takes quite a bit to get two of those down or, or one of each so let's stop that guy right there die <laughs> ice spirit go go no <laughs> he died from the arrows there, man. That was perfect. So let's drop the bowler right there. Hurry, hurry. Royal Giant, go. Okay, perfect. So we got one on each side. Good. He's going to ignore that balloon. That's good. So watch as they engage the towers here. You're going to notice that the bowler has slightly less range. He gets up a little closer to the tower and he takes damage quicker. You can see his health is going down well, he just has less health. I don't know why I said he takes damage quicker. No, he just has less health than the Royal Giant. So in the end, the Royal Giant is probably going to win. You can see here, he's actually going to take down the tower, but they were pretty similar. You know, they have similar damage. They do similar damage. So expect to see them in the same kind of armies, sort of, you know, you're going to have him as like one of your main dudes. He's going to be like your, your tanking guy that also does good damage. I think it's going to be pretty interesting to see like what people do with this with this bowler. I think I'm going to use him. I mean, once I get him leveled up, I think this is going to be a great card to use. And the and the ice spirits as well. I think those are going to be a real easy to use, real handy card to have. So that's about it, guys. Looks like nothing else is going to happen. Let's just drop some cards. You yeah. go. <laughs> what? <laughs> Did he just fireball my uh Wow, man. You never know with these trainers, dude. They <laughs> they do the craziest stuff. Earlier I was in the trainer and he rocketed some fire spirits. Good idea. <laughs> anyway, let's do this again, guys. We're going to do this again. I'm going to drop the Royal Giant. We don't need him. I just wanted to show uh, in this one. And before we do that, why don't we go look at the stats of these new cards? All right, dudes, here we go. This is the stats right here. And you can see, you know, similar to the Royal Giant, we've got 100 damage per second. That's pretty much the same as the Royal Giant. And the hit points are pretty solid. They're not quite 2,000. And the Royal Giant has over 2,000. So that's really where it has its advantage. But I think the bowler has the advantage with this... Um, its ability to sort of target anything. It can target anything as long as it's on the ground. So it can defend itself. I think I like that. All right, so here we go. Uh, wow, area damage again is 100. You know, kind of like what we just saw with, with, the, with the bowler. And this can target, of course, air and ground. It's very fast. Expect, you know, similar things from the fire spirit. Anyway, let's go do this again, guys. We'll do another quick test match. Let's go. So guys, uh, good luck to the trainer Marvin here. We're gonna do just some fun this time. We're not gonna really you know, try hard or anything. Let's go. So there's one. Oh, of course he drops a balloon, dude. Why do they always have the balloon and the trainer? Ah. Anyway, we'll just let it go. We'll just let it hit us. And it's not going to hit us too bad anyway. And we'll drop another bowler right here. 
try to hit that giant. Yeah. Look at that, dude. I mean, it, it takes out the giant pretty quickly. You got to remember the giant has huge health. Even at level five, he's sick. So we're taking him out pretty quickly here. It looked pretty good. Now let's drop some fire spirits. <laughs> Stop fireballing me, man. And the ice spirit, go. Yeah. Oh, it's going to be sick. If he, if he were to drop anything right now, it would just get demolished. Look at that, dude. I think that's going to be sick. If you combine the ice spirits and the fire spirits, the ice spirits can stop big cards. You know, like the ice spirit can stop a hog rider for two seconds. The fire spirits can stop little guys like goblins, barbs. So I think they're going to be good in, you know, combination with each other. You're going to be able to use them for different things. Fire spirits for little guys, ice spirits for big guys. I, I think it's going to be sick, dude. I think it's going to be really fun to use and really easy to use, you know, on defense. Anyway, that's just what I think. Here we go. Let's drop the bowler again. We're going to get a double bowler down once. <laughs> he just zapped our king tower. I love that, man. Wow. Well played. Why can't you use those wow, well played emotes and stuff in, in the trainer? You should be able to. Anyway, looks like we're going to win this one. We got a minute left, but I don't really want to wait a minute. So <laughs> let's just charge through here. Go. Stop fireballing me. No. Ice spirits, go. <laughs> Skeletons, go. Look at this, man. I wish he would drop some troops. I want to see what happens when, you know, if he dropped like some barbarians or something, they would probably just get demolished because they would get frozen and then just lit up by the fire spirits. It'd be pretty sick. So there's the bowler. Go, buddy. And what else do I want to do? I guess I'll, I'll just freeze or zap rather. Oh, looks like we got the, the king tower anyway. All right, dudes, that's it for the second sneak peek. We got some new cards coming to Clash Royale. Let me know what you think about it. I think these cards are, are crazy, right? I mean, these are, they make so much sense. The bowler, we knew that was gonna come eventually, right? I, I did, I expected that to come eventually. And the ice spirit is just so cool. I'll admit I hadn't thought of it, but it's a great idea. So anyway, let me know what you guys think about it. We got a lot more cool sneak peeks coming, guys. I'll see you then, peace.